Made it in India, Piana Sodia, Kadil Jail that's made it in India. Are you from India, India. sir? India. Uh, India. We love India. Um, can you tell us your name and tell us more about your company as well? Uh, myself, Dr. Farooq Abdal. I am from India, Jammu and Kashmir. Uh, here in Crypto uh, Expo here, we are having this uh, booth number 35 today here. We are actually uh, a company, a multinational company, trading in gemstones. Uh, Kashmir blue sapphires and other gemstones, rare rocks uh, globally. But from the last seven to eight years, we are trying that we will provide some type of credibility to the crypto uh, industries. Mm -hmm. Like that, uh, so from 2029 till now, 2019 till now, we, are, we were working upon the regulatory systems, but now we are ready. We have uh, launched our token, that is Blue Sapphire token. That token is uh, backed by our asset, our technology and our physical assets actually. And uh, this group having the multi-ventures, uh, multi-projects, that group is known as BST group of companies. Speaking of crypto, what can you say about the current state of crypto? Before uh, five or six, uh, seven years, people are thinking, everybody is thinking that crypto is a bubble. It is, no. Crypto is actually the future of the currency, future of the economy. The multinational companies, the bigger, bigger, uh, uh, those uh, economical, uh, we can say, the uh, facilities, they are now coming in the crypto. Everything, when there is any revolution, uh, we are thinking that, uh, or we are saying that there are positive, negative, these phases have now opened. Now crypto has reached at that stage where it can never be uh, finished. Now it has to grow. There is a future in the crypto right now that is tokenization, real asset tokenizations. There is Web3 uh, uh, developed uh, websites. These projects, we have to, this, whatever the artificial intelligence, these all are going to mingle with the cryptocurrency. And cryptocurrency is actually now the future. Security is a significant concern in Web3. How does your project ensure the security and privacy of users and data and transactions? There is not only the security issues in the uh, data only or in the privacy only. First type of security must be the security to the investors security to the uh, uh, community who are involved in this thing. Monetary also, data wise also and privacy also. Uh, yes, of course, there must be uh, such measurements of security measurements uh, in every project. But first of all, there must be security to those persons who are monetary involved in that thing. Our project, uh, BS Tokens, we are uh, waiting from last four to five years only to maintain those all small small things when we launch there must be nothing uh, pending yes security uh, of privacy and security of data uh, web3 we are taking the finest measures of, in that thing and web3 is going to change actually the, uh, the credibility of this uh, we can say crypto industries now because of the web3 from last two years we are seeing the uh, flow is coming in this crypto industry because of Web3, but it is security is really too, too much requirement and too much necessary, uh, always. Okay, next question. What do you envision as the future of Web3 and how does your project fit into the vision? Web2 was one period, first Web1, then Web2. Now we are in the artificial intelligence age. We are seeing now chat GPT, everything and web 3 without web 3 no project can go can grow much and more we can our system is uh, in our uh, white paper in the next year after launching only the third uh, i can say nine after nine months we are going to launch our own metaverse auction place till now we are auctioning these our uh, products physically but now we will uh, auction physical uh, products, but in the metaverse, everyone from every part of the world can participate in that. He can buy and he can get the physical thing from us. This is the technology what we are going to introduce in the Web3 designing system. And all Web3 developers, all Web3 uh, companies, developing companies, we are requesting them 
that, that we jointly have to design such type of secure system, uh, credible system, so that everybody can trust that and everybody can benefit from that. Can I have one later? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Last question, what do you think is the future of money? Future of the money, everybody knows. Future of money is right now in this cryptocurrency. There must be a system. Uh, I think from last uh, eight months, globally we are seeing that most uh, consensus are giving up on the tokenization of physical assets. Real world assets should be tokenized and debt must be uh, transformed, debt must be transacted digitally just like a cryptocurrency. Uh, it means that NFT projects, what is the NFT actually, that NFT uh, like if we are transacting anything digitally that should be physically uh, backed by anything, that is the future of money actually. No one wants the system where there are foundations. With the fiat currency, we have foundations. We can't transact it from our own country to anywhere. It takes long time. It takes long expenses. It takes crypto is one thing. Within seconds, we can cross the borders everywhere in the world. But security measures and those other things, those credibilities, if we will match them, the future will be or the money will be crypto, will be uh, NFTs. But only the credible assets, not that only uh, everyone can uh, mint a token that is not actually the future future is the credibility uh, anyone having the credible having the credibility in uh, in their uh, project future is that actually credible digital assets thank you so much and that's it the home marami pa po tayong pag-uusapan dito lang yan sa fomo the future of money